We are in Mascochis, Alberta, and this is our third delivery for this program, the NVS program, Nature Based Solutions. And this one is unique because we are on a First Nations, and there's four bands here, and most of the people know each other. So in the class, they all know each other. I want to say thank you again for inviting us, and on behalf of Eco Canada, we're extremely grateful to be here on Treaty 6, Ermiskin, Neospiak territory. And what I really like is some of our content has to do with Indigenous rights, but all of our content has to do with nature-based solutions. For people as well, so there's the differences in how formally you speak. Potentially One of the things that was really special about this is we actually were graced with the presence of some of the elders from the community, and they were able to impart a lot of their own life lessons and stories and conveying some really powerful words to us as they shared their own experiences, which really helped enlighten the whole concepts we were trying to convey. A course like this is important for our community in order to have an open dialogue on climate change and making sure that the, the youth are well informed, but also informed in the ways they can be participants so it's pretty critical that we try to save Mother Earth as much as we can and put in less toxins into the waters, into Mother Earth. As an individual looking forward seven generations ahead. And so what you do or don't do today impacts all those unborn children. So we need to make sure that we are doing our part to make sure that that education is passed down, but we, that to make sure that it's also scientific and indigenous worldview together. By past the uh, construction sites I've been on, seeing all the, the, the wrongs that have been committed in the past and helping to try and change the industry, I guess. I wanted to learn how we could make a positive difference um, within our environment and if like there's any concerns, um, come up with solutions to fix them. I think there's so much room to grow it and continue on with the flow of the course, right, and to expand the curriculum, to have it even more of a connection to different communities, right? And I think through the influence of the people that we've been communicating with over the Calgary, Vancouver, and then this one as well, we can really grow the course to something really special. And I know some people are already exploring, saying, where could I go with this? How could I learn more about this and maybe get a going, get a foothold in a career? And to get more experience and knowledge from environmental uh, workers, like my father himself. I learned a lot of uh, different mindsets to have throughout safety issues and jobs that we have in the environment and to notice that there's different issues and uh, situations and problem solving in different environments no matter where. You know, our Creator puts us all on this earth. You're meant to be up with the sun and to be doing something with your life. Do it by protecting your Mother Earth, by protecting Creator's creations and making sure you understand your language and your way of life and making sure that you do something and help and pass on these teachings as well to your children and future generations to come.